you never know what to expect driving around in the wet season up in the top end of Australia. Road closures are all too common and the rain comes in big heavy waves. There's greenery and wildlife absolutely everywhere and there's one special lizard that really comes out during this time of year and you're about to see just that lizard. How cool is this? This is a frilled neck lizard or a frilled dragon. Probably the most iconic lizard in Australia. Look at that, flicking out the tail, puffing that frill out and opening the mouth right up. Pretty much just a defensive display saying, get away from me or I'm gonna have a crack, I'm not afraid. So he's puffing out that frill using cartilage rods at the back of it there. And you can see where we are, this sort of savanna habitat, big eucalypts, pandanus. This is a prime habitat for frillies. This is sort of the typical area you'll see them. And not only will they eat insects, but they'll take down, you know, small reptiles, even small rodents and things like that. They're pretty game at what they'll have a crack at. And this, just by looking at it, I'd say as a female, the males typically have a bit of a bigger build, a bit of sexual dimorphism in them where you'll see the males have a bigger head larger at the base of the tail where the reproductive organs are stored, the hemipans. And it's actually shedding its skin as well. You'll notice flaking skin coming off here, off the frill, back of the frill. So that's a sign that this animal is, is healthy. It's still growing. It does look in very good nick, thick legs, thick tail, thick in the body as well. So it's obviously in a good bit of habitat. And we just saw him or saw her run across the road and then what they'll normally do is take up, go up a tree they see uh, sort of a way to get away from a predator. Something like a floodplains monitor, cats, feral dogs, make an easy meal out of a, a frilly. Not that the frilly wouldn't put up a fight, but climbing up a tree might give them a better chance against predators like that. But yeah, they're such an amazing lizard to see and a real icon of, the, of northern Australia. You do get them sort of across the whole northern band of Australia from east coast to west coast. We're in Darwin, up the top. Just look at that. Might leave this girl on her way. Leave her to enjoy the rest of her day. This is a prime example of a big male really. Look how much bigger that head is compared to that girl we found. Big bulky broad head even the frill itself is just that little bit bigger still got that same fiery attitude and they'll follow you opposite around the tree they'll just keep moving around the back of it trying to get away whipping out might leave him don't want to stress him out in the heat but that's just so good to see the colors on this guy are insane <laughs> Red Tank, 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 Red T